Hello and welcome to Make Family History 7. We're talking about projects we can do to display all of our research. Uh, as you see, today my cat joined me. That one's Angel. So what we see here are different frames that I have gotten either through family or garage sales or secondhand stores, etc. Trying to get a variety of photos to display some of the pictures you see some I've already picked out and display these on my wall. Now this is one of my grandmother when she was about seven years old. You can't really remain in this frame or it'll have to be matted. But aside from the frames, I'm actually toying with the idea of a shadow box. So in the previous um, video, I mentioned my grandmother's little tin cup. Well, not tin cup, pardon me. This is silver, silver plated. She had that when she was small, like in the photo. And this particular item, which is a napkin holder. So, should I pin the photo in there? And then use little cup screws. Hang them from the top. Hang them from the side. And include these little items about my grandmother to tell more about her life. And so I have to decide that. I think I'll play with a few people and try to figure out if the items that I have from them are uh, a good idea to put in a shadow box. How much of a story it'll tell. And whether it's a frame or a shadow box, I plan on uh, identifying everybody and everything so that anybody a generation or two from now will know what they're looking at. And, of course, I'll probably have extra photos. Because, you see, this is my grandmother. And that one photo might fit in the shadow box. But then this with four of her children, four of the six, when she's... Hmm, about 40 right here, maybe a little younger. Uh, where should that go? That won't fit in the box with her. So I may have to have another area that just has sort of other photos or backup photos. Again, making sure I identify everybody and putting down the information here where it can be seen. Or here, where it can be seen. Down by the feet of the children. And, of course, I'm also looking at sending this particular item to Grassland's Hospital, if it's still open. Because this is my grandfather when he was working there, and he stopped by the children's ward. You guys have a good day. Enjoy your family history.